And a big lesson here is for people to move away from opinions and into expertise. And so a quick example, I had a group in healthcare of nurse practitioners and they were a committee and they had some turnover. And when I asked the people why they left, people said that they went to the other hospital because they paid more. And so this group became focused on that compensation piece where like, we need to improve our pay so that we don't lose people and we can recruit. If only we paid more, everything would be fine. And so their leader asked me to facilitate with them. And I went in, I just started the awareness and I said, so before we get into design and compensation um, for nurse practitioners, you know, what do you guys know about compensation? Talk to me about some of your expertise and, you know, what do you think are the drivers of motivation? And what's Daniel Pink talk about in Drive? And, you know, and, and they soon realized they knew nothing about it. And so I'm like, well, we need to really be aware. So why don't I give you assignments? Do a lit review. Here's some articles to read. Here's some books to read. Let's get more skilled so that we can make a decision since you guys want to change compensation. And what was so funny about that is after three meetings, they said to us, they go, you know, this is so complex. Like money doesn't necessarily motivate. I think we need an expert. And I'm like, oh my gosh, let's look in the organization if we have an expert. And oh my gosh, there's a whole department. They're, they're compensation specialists. <laughs> and they do market pricing and they do like, they just, they know a lot about this. And so let's invite them into our group. But basically, of course, they heard we've already done all of that. Money doesn't motivate. And they don't really pay 50 cents more an hour. This is like, and it was just one of those ways where people wanted to use their opinions to really take us on a wild goose chase instead of their expertise.